Ah, uh, well, I got no Reapers, so it's not worth it. Yeah. I made two references to Zelda already. What can I say? Right, can I get out of that window? Yes, I can. Go on. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> I've just jumped out. Well, for the tower, and I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not. This is a very quiet game. There's no, there's no music. Only the wind and the echoes of your footsteps. It's a very eerie game. This game. And um, yeah, it's um, it's creepy in a sense. It is quite creepy. And actual main reason why I'm playing it is because I actually recently found it at a game shop and decided to buy it. After not playing it for years, I wanted to try it out. And also the fact I, I wanted a Let's Play Spyro 2, but it turns out I am uh, my disc is in the loft because we did a bit of like redecorating in my house. We had to move some stuff upstairs. That's irrelevant. Let's talk about let's talk about this game. Oh, there's a ladder here. Jump up the stairs. <laughs> God, the ambient is just so creepy. Ooh, camera angle change. You, you can zoom in any time you want, which is really cool. So you can have like a more of like a a, a cinematic feel. And like, the camera angle is really good. Like you can, you can control it all the time, no matter what. So you can so you can tell where to go. You can if you're having some like problems spotting something, you can zoom in. Very clever. Very cool. There's a chain here. Whoa. Okay. I can't. Can I? Yeah. There we go. Yeah, that's the right way. <laughs> Oops, didn't mean to go on that. <laughs> Let's keep going. This is a really long staircase. Well, kind of staircase. I guess it's like kind of like the, the heart of the tower. Oh, there's a cage. Oh, there's a girl in it. Who are you? I like your hat. It's a Viking. What are you doing in there? Yes, so the universe of Ica has a like a unique language they've made up. And also, I forgot to tell you, if you didn't know already, I, I, I assume some of you have played this game and know about it, so I'm not going to go in saying like you're, you're dumbasses and you don't know what this game is, but for... Like for those of you who don't know what this game is, this game is also connected to Shadow of Colossus, which is a another game on the PlayStation 2, which is on the same universe. And that game is very cool. And both games are considered widely the best games on the system, so... Quality here. Very good quality. How do I get across? I can't jump that, can I? Thought not. Oh, Jesus. Why didn't he even attempt that? That was clearly not possible. This, <laughs> this reminds me of the scene from Batman where you're trying to jump over that that little ridge in the prison. Yeah, that bit. Trying to get... I'm going to keep doing it until I do it. Can I jump on these windows? Yes, I can. Oh. I can actually go out. Very cool. Whoa. Very cool. Yeah, this game was also remade on the PlayStation 3 as a HD... Well, but a HD remake. So... 
I have never played it, so I I assume it's got better graphics. You know, HD remakes usually do. So if you have got a PlayStation 3, I definitely like I recommend you check it out. Right, I reckon if I go in this window here, I'll be on the other side of that gap. I am a genius. Not really, but I'm a genius anyway. Huh. I'll just switch. Whatever you do, do not jump. I'm going to be so pissed off if there's a toad in there saying, Sorry, the princess is another castle. Damn you, toad. <laughs> Speaking of Mario, I, this kind of reminds me of doing like the long jumps on uh, Super Mario 64. Speedrunner's tactics. Go a bit faster. Do a bit of jumping. Now, let's go all the way back down. See if we can open that cage. <laughs> hey, this saves time, alright? I'm not just walking. This guy can jump for miles, so. He's cool with it. These fences, I just want to jump over. But, they're covered in spikes, so I don't think I recommend that. Ooh. Hello. You think I'll get on top there then? Let's try it. Hmm. Ah! There's a chain. Can I go on the chain? Let's have a look. Should have, uh, should have already sussed out there was a chain on there, but whatever. I think if I go on the chain, I'll have enough force to uh, break the cage. Let's line myself up quickly. Yeah. Oh wow! Terrible, terrible display, lady. If you're not laughing, what is wrong with you? You're clearly not a human, because that was pretty funny. I'm going to keep doing it until I probably get killed, and then you're going to be in that cage forever. Whoa! Yeah. Yeah. Don't fall. Please. <laughs> Can't camera a bad camera angle. Hey! No! Ugh. Jumping in video games, you all know I'm good at it, right? Also ladders. Ladders suck. But at least in this game they work. Third time's a charm, right? <laughs> Please? Please? Yeah! Wow, 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 wow. This is embarrassing. This yeah, just jump into the wall and knock yourself out, mate. That's smart of you. Uh, it's almost 20 minutes in and I haven't even rescued the girl yet. Oh, I'm an embarrassment. I can't really line myself up, can I? There's no... Aha! Ah. Consider yourself rescued! Oh, it's only a stick. I'll have that. You are. Uh, you should put some um, shoes on, love. Actually, you're really pale. You should get that seen to. I, I, I can't understand that. <laughs> Oh, okay. Kids with horns are brought here. Oh! Oh! Ah! I remember these things. These things are horrible things. I should um, do something about that. 
You're really white, it's weird. <laughs> You're coming with me. Get, get the stick, get the stick, get the stick. How do I get this? How do I get the stick? Pick it up. Oh, yeah. No! You bastard! No! 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 How do I? How do I? How do I? How do I do it? How do I? Hold up. I don't know how to. D well, she's dead. And I'm dead too. How do I. How do I lift her out? I know you can do that, I remember her. Oh, bollocks. Let's not go through this again. Yes, yes, I know. She's been dragged into a time portal. Just fucking run. Get, get out of here. Just go. Shoot. 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 Get out of here. Leave the girl alone. Leave the poor girl alone. Cool. Alright. Hi. How do I... No, don't hit her. No, don't. It's X? It's X. How do I lift her up? Get up, woman! Oh, it's R1. She needs to be here. Yeah, I agree. Them black creatures are not nice things. Not being racist or anything. Oh, I'm holding her hand. Oh, I remember. I, yeah. <laughs> if you <laughs> you run too far, it looks like you're literally going to like pull her arm off. Be gentle with her. Where do I go? Yeah, okay, yeah just, I'm not going to pull your arm because that's just really mean. Yeah, I need... Okay. First... First things first, we need to find you some shoes because you've got to step into a pebble. It's gonna be painful, and I'm not going to. I'm not going to help you. Actually, actually come here. Get over here, woman. What is this thing, and how do I open it? Oh. Oh, you can do that. Yeah, how did you do that? Seriously. Glass of water. Let's keep going. The Yankee armor. Come on. So I don't think she can climb up things. Well, she can, but she needs your help. High objects, you have to help her up and stuff, which is really unique. There's uh, something about this game I like is its companionship, and you really do feel for characters. You really want them to succeed and stuff, and help each other out. Look at that. If there's any game that want to teach you about helping out this game. Also yanking off arms apparently. I was saying this would be an actual really good co-op game. What about it? Yeah, it could work. Where are we? Oh, the sofa. Yeah, I could uh, take a rest. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, 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 it's a chair. I know what chair. I just like shoo her away. How do I? How do I? How do I? There we go. Sit on the chair. Sit on the chair. Well, come on. Come on. Ah, that's how you save in this game. Are you kidding me?